This is another inspiring story. This one of resilience. A Hurricane High School student survived a serious accident but was left paralyzed. But she didn't give up. For this week's Your Life, Your Health, medical specialist Emma Benson explains that she had a goal to accomplish. Isn't that right, Emma? That is sure right. <laughs> yeah, I recently spoke with Madison Gill and her mom, and it's pretty incredible. Maddie's life was completely turned upside down, but that did not deter her from wanting to walk across the graduation stage. I'm just glad I'm still alive. Madison Gill is no stranger to struggle. It's been a lot of ups and downs. Two years ago, Maddie was driving home from Sand Hollow with her friends. We were at the lake all day. When their truck rolled. I just kept like trying to get up. She remembers lying on the ground. When the first responders got there, they kept saying, can you feel this, can you feel that? And I'm like, feel what? <laughs> so that's when I knew, I was like, ooh, something's, something's messed up. Maddie was rushed to St. George Regional Hospital with a spinal fracture. And they said she's very bad go straight to the hospital. Her mom, Bridget, hurried to her side. I just kept apologizing to her because I didn't have my seatbelt on, so I'm like, this is all my fault. I kept telling her I didn't want to die like this. <laughs> it was, if she makes it through surgery, she'll never walk again. After spending months in the hospital and inpatient rehab, she returned home and began to adjust to her new reality. There were setbacks that halted her progress, like the death of a friend, but she remained resilient. One day she says, I want to walk across the stage at graduation. Maddie started working with intermounted physical therapist Tyson Winder. And I could just see from the get-go that she just was like not going <laughs> to take no for an answer. It's required hard work and consistency. Even like getting up and just walking around the house, I make that like a goal of mine every day. But step after step, she's been getting stronger. Then, in May of this year... Madison Gill! With Tyson by her side and her family in the stands... I was just like, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. Maddie walked across the stage to receive her high school diploma. It was cool to, to be there, and, and Maddie was a champion and was able to do it. What was once thought to be impossible... She proved everybody wrong. Maddie showed through determination that she can do anything. Don't let people tell you what you can and can't do because you're going to prove them wrong either way. Well, she definitely proved them wrong. What's next for Maddie? She's continuing to get stronger, and she's actually hoping to go to college and pursue a degree in medicine. So quite the comeback story. Wow. I'm just so impressed with yeah. her attitude about everything. It chokes you up to see her at graduation. Oh, yeah, it really does. Wow, great Walked story. Thanks stage. a lot, Emma. Thank you. Uh -huh.